Good morning everyone, this is Jack with Northwest Bus Sales and today I'm going to be showing you a 2009 Bluebird All-American front engine. Uh, this is a full-size 40-foot school bus here, equipped with underfloor storage, powered by the Cummins Allison Combo. I'm excited to show it to you. Let's check it out. So I'm uh, going to go on inside here. First things first, we have an air-operated uh, passenger entry door here, bifold. Uh, we have a pebble step tread on the inside, which uh, actually looks pretty good going all the way up. White step nosing. And a lot of times this back wall here is going to be absolutely trashed, but uh, it actually looks pretty good going through here. i um, got a grab rail on the left here to help people in. And uh, before we do the uh, driver area here, I'm going to show you the engine. This is a uh, Cummins 6.7 liter turbo diesel engine. Check it out. Two hundred and sixty horsepower engine. Again, two hundred and sixty horsepower engine. Also accompanied with the Allison automatic transmission. All right, so the cockpit area here. We got your driver's seat upholstery, which looks great. No big rips, cuts, tears, anything like that. Going all the way down and up. I'm uh, gonna sit down here. Uh, going from right to left, we have your uh, school bus stop paddle and crossing arm. Uh, controls here but those have been removed so these are just blank buttons at this point uh, open and close the door right here we got your uh, Allison automatic transmission shift pad here uh, all your heaters you have two front heaters two rear heaters driver heater heater booster pump your defrost all that's right here again this does not have AC but uh, does have these awesome fans here if the driver needs and uh, you know school buses don't usually run in the summer so they're not really needed up here uh, I did notice this has a VGT brake, Variable Geometry Turbo Brake. So I've not confirmed if this works, but uh, basically that's, a, that's basically kind of like an exhaust brake, but it's on the turbo. So kind of cool. Having, actually, I actually have never seen one of those, so pretty cool. Uh, cruise control, on and off for those long nights. <laughs> Mileage, 76,000 miles again 76,965 miles this baby's got a lot of life left in it high idle switch it is working it's working right now you can see where the rpms are at uh, your lights over here got your dome lights right here these are the controls for these fans i was talking about just like that see those work and then uh the the outside mirrors are heated as you can see right there a little heated switch and uh, up top here, this does have a Panasonic AM, FM, CD stereo. Again, AM, FM, CD stereo and a PA jack down here towards the driver in the little clip there. If you want to add a microphone. So pretty cool. All right. So uh, checking out the back here. This is a 84 passenger school bus. Again, 84 passengers. Equipped with your standard uh, brown vinyl covered bench style seating, which you see in pretty much every school bus. Uh, seat covers look awesome. There's a little bit of a patch there, you can see that, but a lot of them are looking pretty good. And you're going to see little patches here and there, but over and above all, there's no foam sticking out, no big holes, stuff like that. Looks pretty dang good going down. <clears throat> Uh, up top we got two emergency roof hatches. We have speakers zigzagging their way down the aisle. We have dome lights on the left and right side here above the uh, above the seats. Floor feels in good shape. Don't feel any soft spots, anything like that. As far as I can tell, feels good. And uh, we've been getting a lot of people interested in conversion. People are converting these things. The number one question is the interior dimensions. See how much room they got. So uh, from the back to the back wall here, basically right there, uh, it's 34 feet, 6 inches, interior length, 34 feet, 6 inches, interior width is 7.5 feet, 7 feet, 6 inches, interior width, interior height, 6'4", six, 6 feet, 4 inches, and bumper to bumper length is 40 feet. So you got, if you think of it like a rectangle, you got 34.5 by 7.5. 
and then uh, interior height is 6.4. So there you go. There's the interior dimensions for you. And we'll check out the outside. I'm going to show you the uh, front the passenger side tire here. Pan of the undercarriage. Uh, I got your underfloor storage. It is not passed through. These are just pods, but still quite a bit. You got it in the back and in the front here, so that's always nice. Coming around the side, side skirts look great. No big dents, gouges, or scratches, anything like that. Looks good. Going down, gonna show you the rear. Passenger side duals. Rolls a nice pan underneath here. Rear pods here. And we have the same configuration on the driver's side. But I left one open and one closed so you can see what it looks like with both. Uh, coming around the back here, we have your uh, rear corners. This kind of tends to be where you'll see the most damage on a school bus, and there's not a whole lot of evidence of that. Looks good. Windows are nice and tinted in the back. All the windows are tinted, even on the side. Got a little bit of some action right here. You can see that. A few little, few little scratches. Nothing too crazy. And again, same underfloor storage on the driver's side. This is what it looks like closed. Looks good. And we also have your beautifully tinted windows. Actually, a pretty dark tint. Gives them a nice look. I'm uh, gonna show you your rear driver's side duels. Again, another little pin in the undercarriage here. And this side is looking good as well. Battery box and slide out tray. A lot of times these are completely rusty because the battery acid and everything, but this actually looks good in here. Ain't bad. Okay, I can't get that close with one hand. Okay, anyways, we got your uh, front passenger side tire. Sorry, driver side tire. And a nice pan underneath. Thank you for watching this Northwest Bus Sales exclusive video tour. If you like this bus or any other buses in our lot, you can call us at 1-800-231-7099, visit us at nwbus.com, or email us sales at nwbus.com. Thank you very much for watching.